G'day folks, let's test out my recent piece of uh, rack filler that I found at a uh, swap meet recently. Uh, 4.5 terabytes of storage expansion. Unfortunately I didn't realise it needs Vault drives, the first five of them with the operating uh, system on them. Um, I can get them for about $550 but it's not high on my priorities list. Uh, yeah, I'm going to power it up anyway, see what it does. Probably nothing without a signal from its controller. But the power supplies might kick in. It doesn't actually have a power button, so it's just, I think it's just relying on the power rail of the server to come up, and it's just always on. It's uh, Dell um, EMC. It's actually made by e EMC. Or EMC squared. Pretty decent stuff. They're about $20,000 when they're new. But this one here... Apparently they're all formatted, and that's it. So I need the uh, master vault drives, the two or four gigabyte, uh, 15,000 RPM drives for the first five slots, and the rest of them are storage. But let's turn the power on and see what happens. You need it spinning them up one at a time. That one's not doing anything. That one's trying. Some of them are having trouble. <laughs> It's trying to sort out problems with those drives or not, but it's not happy. The rest of them are all right. Oh, there we go. That one's stabilised. Yeah, and the error's gone away. That's just slowly initialising them and working out what they're doing. That's really cool. I didn't pay much for it for what it is. I think the drives themselves are worth more than what I paid for it, but <laughs> it's just a, uh, at the moment, it's a doorstop until I can get the five volt drives and then keep these five um, 300 gig drives as storage or extra like backups, just put them in the cupboard and then I'll have uh, these 10 300 gig drives to uh, store stuff on. Yeah, that one's taking its sweet time. It's not set in the back plane properly. Oh, they're all green now. It probably hasn't been used for a while and being transported they probably weren't seated all the way in because I didn't pull them all out and reseed them. I only pulled a couple of them out. But they're all hot swappable. And that's what it's running. Coug um, Seagate Cheetah, 10k7 drives. Yep. 
Not a bad bit of kit. The thing weighs a ton. It's about 50 kilos. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna have to shut this off hard anyway. There's no shutdown command or button. I don't like doing that, but that's uh. The only way to turn it off, there's actually no power button. Once the whole rack power rail comes on, they all come up and uh, that's it. They get addressed by the uh, network storage controller. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll do a teardown on this one probably tomorrow afternoon.